What's up, everybody? Crazy Mike D back again. Tonight is a pod review. Tonight's pod comes from Pex Peppers. Uh, my good friend Daniel Harmon had ordered me a bunch of peppers from Pex Peppers. Uh, the owner, Dan, uh, Garrett Peck, had sent me uh, a, a small box of peppers, some really nice ones. Ones that I had, did use for uh, my five pepper challenge. Those were extremely hot. Um, I, he also, I also have a bunch of hot sauces of pear pecks. Of pepper. Pecks peppers. Blah, can't speak tonight. Anyways, uh, one of the peppers he sent me is this one. This is a very unique looking pepper. My wife had called this one flower power, as it does look like a uh, flower, but its name is the SBJ7. It is a cross between the Scotch Bonnet and the Jonah 7 pepper. Um, I have had many Scotch Bonnet uh, peppers, but I've never had a Jonah 7. Uh, so it's very interesting. I don't know any of the information of this pepper, so I'm just going to review of the flavor and the heat on it. So we are going to take the stem off. And I am going to slice this one in half to show you the inside. Because I'm actually pretty interested in seeing what it looks like. Cut it in half. It's a very nice fresh pepper. Does smell hot. Um, doesn't look like it's got too much placenta. It's a pretty, uh, thick wall pepper. We'll get, uh, a picture from my Facebook page. You can add me on Facebook if you'd like. Try to get a good picture here. There we go. Um... I don't put pictures on my videos. Uh, I don't know if some people do, like the Ted Barris and Brad Bishop. They both do the uh, the pictures on their videos. I don't. I, I don't edit my videos at all. Um, it's not that I don't know how. It's that I don't have the uh, equipment right now. I'm only using my cell phone for uploading and recording videos. Does smell really hot. It smells fruity. I do have my uh, spit cup just in case it gets a little hot. I can spit out the cup. I also have my puke bucket. I know a lot of people do like seeing me puke. When I did the five pepper re uh, challenge, I did puke, but it was after I shut off the video. Sorry, guys. But anyways, we're going to review this pepper. Tell you how it tastes and the heat. Both will be rated on a scale of 0 to 10. Very crisp. Fresh. It is hot. But not extremely hot. Sweet. <clears throat> Ooh. <clears throat> it's getting in the back of the throat. <clears> throat. Not so much the tongue. It's mostly just the throat. Um, a little bit on the side of the tongue and the tip. <clears> oh, <throat> wow. It's a throat burner, that's for sure. Um, I'm not sure if that's the Scotch bonnet or the, the Jonas 7 that is doing that. Um, normally scotch bonnets just burn on my, my tongue and not my throat. But this one is mainly just right on the, the middle of the throat and the sides. A little bit on the sides of the tongue and the tip of the tongue, but really not that bad. Um, very sweet. Not floral at all. Whew. Now starting to really build on the tongue. Whew, that was a slow build. 
getting more, building more on the uh, the entire tongue now. <clears throat> Starting to sweat. Still burning on the throat. Whew, haven't seen too many people review this pepper. Um, wow. It was a very good pepper. Starting to die now, now. It was a slow build, but it peaked rather quickly. Um, I rate that heat. Um, not as really as hot as a, probably hotter than a habanero. Not as hard as a, a scorpion pepper or something like that. I think it is a uh, a super hot, and the uh, Jonah Seven makes it a, makes it a super hot because the Scotch bonnet is not a super hot. It's a just a, a hot pepper. Whew. It's dying down now. The flavor of that pepper was very good, very sweet, not floral at all. Not bitter. Um, I do love the appearance of that pepper. It does remind me of a flower. Wow. That was an excellent pepper. Uh, don't, won't be needing my spit cup or my puke bucket tonight because this one is was not an extreme super hot like a Chinana Scorpion. Wow. Wow, that was a great tasting pepper. Heat. I'm going to give that one a 6 out of 10. It was just... It was hotter than habanero, but not by much. Probably a little bit hotter than a scotch bonnet. Wow, great flavor. Great heat. Flavor, I'm going to rate that one a 7 out of 10. Overall, I'm rating that one a 7 out of 10 for our uh, overall score. Thank you, uh, Garrett, for sending me that pepper. Also, thank you for sending me that hot sauce. I'm definitely looking forward to that. I really enjoyed your singularity. I did a review of that last night. <clears throat> that was excellent. I'm very excited to try the other ones that I have uh, received. As you can see, my nose is dripping a little, but uh, yeah. And thank you, Daniel, for ordering me those peppers. I uh, really appreciate that. And thank you all for watching. Like I always say, like, comment, subscribe. And like always, this is Crazy Mike D signing off. Have a great night.